Measuring the thermal conductivity of water. And if we measure the temperature of the water currently, it is about 24 degrees Celsius. However, we are going to measure the water now after it has been heated in order to see its thermal conductivity. So we move it into a pot and we will now heat it. for about 30 seconds. So we turn the f um this heat on, I mean the fire on. And we're waiting for the water to heat up in order to check its thermal conductivity. So right now it's been about 40 seconds and we can see that the vapor has risen on the sides and so it, it's very blurry, the pot is becoming blurry and so we will now um, stop the fire after about a minute of heating. And because the water's heat has been moved onto the pot, I will I have to use a towel to pick up the pot. And now I will move it back into the beaker and test the temperature right away. So as soon as I put the thermometer into the bucket, the temperature rose dramatically. And if you can see, the temperature is now about 41.5 degrees Celsius. So we see that the water has risen by about 17 degrees Celsius just after a minute of heating. And therefore, we can conclude that it has a very high thermal conductivity.